Hey guys, how's it going? Today we're going to talk about how to build a slash command for purging messages inside of a channel. Um, if you already have a bot built, um, this is going to start from a very basic command template. Um, my other videos have shown how I created my commands, but you can do it any way you want and just apply the meat of the execute function to however you do it with yours. Um, that being said, if you are just starting making a Discord bot and you need a, a tutorial on how to make slash commands, um, you can follow one of my previous guides. I'll link in the description um, and it'll fit kind of into this format of how I do messages or how I do slash commands um, and, and kind of get you on a good start um, for this video. Um, but as you can see here, I've kind of built out the scaffold for how I do um, slash commands. I have a data property um, with the slash command builder. You can see I set the name of purge, I set a description, um, and I added the number option of none messages. So let's talk about the limitations a little bit before we get started. Um, you can't delete more than 100 messages at once through Discord's API. Um, it's just a hard stop. Um, there's no way to actually do it. You can't get around it. And you can't delete messages that are older than 14 days. That's just the way it is with the Discord API. Um, deletes are a very heavy operation for them to actually process. And so they limit you um, because of that. So that being said, um, if we look at the execute function, you can see I already have the num messages parsed out of this um, slash command options. Um, interaction the options that get is how you get the value from the interaction options. Um, you pass in the name of the um, parameter and you get the value from it. So the first limitation that I said, like I said, is you can't actually delete more than 100 messages at once. So we're going to say if the number of messages is greater than 100, then we want to return interaction, or return await, interaction dot reply. You cannot delete more than 100 messages at once due to Discord's limitations. Once we have this done, we can actually get to um, the bulk deleting. Um, so there's a very straightforward way to do this. Um, you're going to say await interaction dot channel dot bulk delete. We're going to pass in the number of messages. That is a very simple um, bulk delete, um, uh, or a very simple purge. That is, it's going to actually um, delete the last uh, number of messages that you that you specified, including the um, the way th the message that you invoked the purge with. So that being said. Um, let's start our bot and let's go ahead and test it. You can see that our client's are now ready and it's initialized, so let's go ahead and check to see our purge command has been created. So you can see that if we do slash purge, we can see that the slash command was created. You invoke that any slash command was slash and then the name of the command. And you can see we have a required num messages parameter. So we're going to say we're going to delete the last 10 messages. We're going to press enter. It's sending the command. And then it'll say the application did not respond. So if you don't reply to slash commands, it's going to always say the application didn't respond. That doesn't necessarily mean anything. It just means that uh, Discord did not receive an interaction reply. So we're going to say interaction dot reply messages deleted. Let your bot start again, and we'll test it and see if that error went away. So we're going to say slash purge again. Five messages. Send that. You see messages deleted. It'll uh, it'll uh, actually show that the interaction uh, was successful this time, um, and you can make it say whatever you want. You can also make it say nothing if you want. Um, you just need to actually tell Discord that uh, you know the slash command was successful. But we said messages deleted, uh, and you can customize this message however you please. And it deleted the last five messages. And so let's just test one more time with 150. You can't delete more than 100 messages at once to the Discord limitations. Um, so this is a very simple purge command that we've created here. Um, and this is all you have to do uh, to actually get uh, a purge command up and going. Um, so if you guys like this video, if you could like and subscribe, um, feel free to comment anything you have trouble with. And I will be glad to come in and um, try to help you hop on Discord or whatever, or you know, look at your code on GitHub. Um, and yeah, thank you.